I'm excited. How well do I know Matt Dario? I, I know. love filming in New York. Ooh. I have lived in New York for most of the years of my life. I, I wonder which have one lived like on the west side of New York. Uh, I think the lie is that you've lived on the west side of That is area. correct. Ding, 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 you are correct. <laughs> ding, 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 ding. <laughs> she got I it right. I have not lived on the west side. I have gone up and down the east side, but I've never ventured over to the wrong side. <laughs> All New York related. We love it. Okay. Toria? I have sung a Christmas medley for Barack Obama. I just bought a car. And... My third one will be that I don't tell many people this, but I have a third nipple. I'm gonna go with the mundane is the lie. I'm gonna say that you uh, you didn't just buy a car. You think buying a car is a lie? I think that is a lie. You are incorrect. incorrect. I don't. <laughs> oh, you you don't have a third nipple? I do not have a third nipple. I'm well, surprised no, you went with the car with that one. What a, what a complete wacko thing to just make up about a, having a third nipple. Always know when someone is lying for yeah. sure. Hell yeah. First of all, you're on the morally correct side of everything. Second yeah. of all, you, you can use that tool for everything. You know, that's a good first date question. And if they say, I'd rather get away with lying all the time, you'd be like, all Bet right, you know. <laughs> yep. see each other. Cool, ever. actually. Well, uh, in Titanic, the guy dies at the end. That's the product. Yeah, trust. I'd rather be alive. <laughs> I would have to say trust. Too, trust yeah. is. I have social media again. Is that, social is that an option? Media. Can I just do I'm that? Just, I'll, never, like, never love. can ever access social media, any app, any platform ever. Sounds, sounds fantastic. Sure. Here's the deal. Uh, I was sure. always asked this question as a kid, and I never really understood the answer. Oh, the reason you have a million dollars is to be happy. Right. That's why you have a million dollars. If you just have a million dollars, but you're unhappy, then what's the million dollars doing for you? So, through love, does it bring me full happiness? And I would assume, yes. I don't need a hundred million dollars. Just give me enough to, to you know, get some food and have a little place to live. And true love, true easy, love. easy, 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 easy as pie. True love, it is. Both yeah. of you. Ooh, be an yeah. artist for sure. Yep. I, that's interesting. Be, be an artist. Like if you own the gallery, you're not an artist at all. I think both are great options. <laughs> you don't have to be, you're, you're, what are you, a politician? <laughs> uh, what do you mean? I think both are great options. I think not, question, why does that have to have a binary answer? It's, it's, these things are, real life is not black and white. Nice outfit. It's, uh, you know, it's, um, you have to choose they're, one. They're more, like it's work. like the movie. The answer is not so clear. That's okay. the point. Okay, both. He gets both. <laughs> That's fine. I'd rather be broke. Oh, I don't know. I think, you know, I always defend Owen. I'm, I'm going to defend Owen to the death just because, like, I defend Owen. I got to say I'd rather be Owen, but I think the emotional toll. Yeah. Oh. Tough. Owen's a good guy. I don't know. That's a tough question. I'm going to go with Owen because you said Brooke. Right. And Vic, why would you want to be uh, Brooke? What's like the thought behind it? Um, I would want to be Brooke because I feel like she, I don't know. I mean, she didn't actually cheat. Yeah. You know? um, so I don't think she Well, wait a minute. Carry around that guilt. <laughs> what do you mean you didn't cheat? She didn't cheat. She might, she may oh. have. You know, Define cheat. What do you have to have a certain thing happen for it to be cheating? What What is the? Well, I think, I think. Well, I think that there are different kinds of cheating for sure. Yeah. I think, you know, she did do some emotional cheating in there for sure. So at the end of the day, I think, you know, Brooke made the decision to call the decoy, which maybe wasn't the best thing to do. But hey, she was stressed out. She was having a lot of a doubt and insecurity. She was seeing all these clues of, of seemingly shady things that, that Owen was doing, sneaking out late at night. So she made this choice. And 
I just think, you know, Owen, Owen did, he made the, the, the moral choice to go through with it. And, uh, yeah. I think that, I think that, I think that the stakes of your, the reasons behind the cheating are as important as the cheating under certain circumstances. And I think this is one of them. And I think that in the event that you involve yourself knowingly in a situation uh, that you as a partner would not want to see from your other partner that you've already crossed that line, then how deeply you bury that through lying then sort of adds insult to injury. I can see where it all comes down to trust rather than to necessarily. Right, but at the end of the action. day, you did make the choice to go ahead with it. You didn't have to. And you know, Brooke made the choice to end listening. up half naked in the uh, lips, lips a millimeter away. I mean, you know, distances, we could say that we're never really touching anything because the atoms aren't touching. I mean, what's the distance for quiet? But I don't think, I don't it? think Brooke, I, I hear what you're saying. I totally hear what you're saying. But I, I don't think that she went any further with him there. I think she- well, I don't know. I don't know what you're saying. I don't think that, I think that's up for audiences to Did decide. Did you guys feel this, like, compassionate about it when you were reading the script? Or kind of after the fact when it was like you wrapped filming, realizing what really, really went on. I, I'm a ruthless defender of Owen. I just, I gotta yeah. defend him. Cause uh, you know, I, I gotta defend my character. You guys excited about like when you read the script to play the roles? Oh yeah. Yeah, yeah. definitely, definitely. I love so many things about my character. I love that she's like this like determined, um, strong-minded woman. She's kind of like a boss, you know? She, yeah. she has her own gallery. She's calling the shots. She knows what she wants. She's like making moves. Um, I love that about her. I love that it takes place in the art world. I love like her sense of style. Yeah. Her, my clothes were so cute. Um, so it was super fun. And the fact that it takes place in New York was really fun. And I also love the whole, you know, our relationship dynamic. So I was super excited to play this role and do this movie. Okay. Brooke, is, Brooke is very cool and she's very focused on what she wants to do, but she has certain insecurities in her relationship, right. which makes her feel very real. And then Owen is, you know, kind of, He's a newscaster. He's kind of a, he's in a stagnant position in his life where he's not really moving forward. And, and and you can see it on his face. He looks a little worn out. Yeah. And I like that about him. I like that he's just kind of, he's this kind of worn out guy, you know? It's believable yeah. that he's, he's going to make a mistake, you yeah. know? Yeah. I think that's what I like about the story at the, at the end of the day is that like we're both, you know, flawed characters. And my character right. obviously has a lot of insecurities and and neuroses and doubt and um, nobody's perfect and we all make choices and we all make mistakes and um, I think it's going to bring up interesting conversations like you know who yeah. did cheat what is considered cheating who is in the right who is in the, the right? levels yeah there's lots of layers to it which right. I think is, is interesting totally well thank you guys so much for uh, playing the two games and thank can't you. wait to, can't wait for the world to see the movie well, thank you very much. It was really fun. Thank you.